Hey guys, Inventor719 here with a quick life hack. Um, today I'll be showing you a really short video of how to increase the power of your remote control. Um, really simple, all you're going to need is your remote control. This one is just um, not functioning, but it will work the same. Um, you're going to need a screwdriver to get into your remote control. In my case, it's a really small Phillips screwdriver. And lastly, just some aluminum foil, tin foil, whatever. As long as it's reflective, it should work. Now, let's get started. First step, obviously, get into your remote control. Normally, there's a few screws on the back. You're also going to want to take out the batteries. I've already done so, just for a safety precaution. So, mine has one, two screws right there. Then I should be able to open it up. Once you got your remote open, it should look something like this. Got the buttons, we won't be needing those right now. And the circuit board, and on the circuit board at the end you will see the LED light. And so this is an infrared light which is used to connect the TV wirelessly to the remote. So this is what we're going to be dealing with. So you can take off your circuit board and just set that aside for a few seconds. And then you're going to take a really small piece of aluminum foil. I just cut some off with some scissors and maybe fold it a few times. Um, again, really small, I might actually cut this in half. And basically what you're gonna wanna do is make it the same width, uh, just about, as the height of the LED light, so still much a bit too big. So right about that there, just like that. And then put it just like there in your light, if you can't see that. And very simply just wrap it 360 degrees around the light. Make sure it doesn't touch any of the connector ports for the batteries either. And if you squeeze it in place, it should stick to itself. And you're going to simply want to just make a cone shape kind of, or a cylinder, whatever, just like that around your light. And now that, what that's going to do when we put it back together is direct the direct the light towards your TV so as long as you're pointing at your TV you'll be able to get more distance now simply re-put together your remote I have reassembled the remote and as you can see there's the little bit of aluminum foil around the infrared light on the end so that is how you increase the power of a TV remote now it'll be more directed and be able to go farther so you can control your TV from a further distance Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this quick little video. And as always, please like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.